Hello friends, welcome back to this channel. In this video, I am going to give you the solutions for cyber security week 3. So this is the one. So let's see the first question. Which one of the following refers to lack of ability to survive the effects of a hostile environment? So the answer for first question is third option that is vulnerability. And moving to second question, point out the correct representation to link vulnerability, threat, asset and risk. So for second question, the answer is first option, that is risk equals vulnerability into threat. Moving on to third question, these types of threats are any programs that are designed specially, specifically to harm the system. So the answer is third option that is intentional threats moving on to fourth question this can be used to test websites in order to detect unknown software vulnerabilities and invalid configurations in network or web applications so for fourth question the answer is fourth option that is application scan And moving on to the fifth question, name the system used in an in the external environment to detect the presence of an intruder attempting to breach the boundary. The answer for fifth question is first option perimeter based IDS. And moving on to the sixth question, select the functions of anomaly based detection system. So for sixth question, the probable answers, that is third, third option, A and C, that means detection of unwanted traffic and C, finding new attacks. Moving on to the seventh question, here if you see the first statement, IP fragmentation flag route program interrupts and redirects traffic destined for a specific host. So I will show you uh, a document. So if you see this, in this attack, flag, flag root program interrupts, rewrites egress. I don't know this meaning actually. I think uh, they have uh, made some small mistake. Uh, uh, instead of writing redirects, they gave rewrite and egress. So hope that hoping that uh, it is same meaning as the talk given in the assignment. Here redirects. This will be true. If the meaning is not same, it will be false. But I hope that uh, it is a, it is a spelling mistake. So I think uh, their intention is to give the correct one only. So in that hope, I am uh, considering this as first statement as true, and second is absolutely true. So, fourth option, true and true, is the correct answer. If the first statement uh, meaning uh, are different from what I have shown and redirects, then it first one will be false and second one will be true. That means second option is also possible if they give a uh, different meaning than redirects. So, hope that they give us uh, both statements correct, then fourth option is the correct answer. And eighth question. The answer is fourth option that is first one matches for B, second one for E, third one for A, fourth one for C and fifth one for D. And moving on to the ninth question. Sequence of flow of network based IDPS uh, where it takes place in system process. So the probable answer for ninth question is third option that is DBACE first one is a router next one is network based IDS or IPS next one is untrusted client next one is firewall and next final one is server that is third option and the final question of the assignment that is tenth one first statement vulnerability refers to unknown weakness of asset or resource exploited by more attackers this statement is true 
and next one is measuring and determining the need for mitigation is one of the most vital part of the risk management until until now it is correct but it is not under stakeholders perspective but they gave stakeholders perspective so uh, second statement is false first one is true that is option third option is correct answer so friends these are the solutions for week 3 cyber security assignments uh, so hope this video is helpful for you if you feel the same please subscribe our channel like this video and share to your friends if you have any doubt please ask in the comment section i will try to reply to the valid queries so for further videos uh, and assignments regarding different courses and also the cyber security course so please subscribe our channel like this video and share to your friends keep supporting our channel uh, before the submission day once again uh, view, uh, visit the comment section because if I make any change I will update there and also on the thumbnail of the video so until then goodbye thank you